Hello friends, so let's talk about the precision in the measurement system analysis. Uh, PCB Pro, PCB Pro much circuit boards for use in variety of uh, electronic devices uh, from cell phones to, uh, to onboard computers in airplanes. Technicians at the PCB Pro need to measure the circuit boards carefully to ensure that the distances distances between both components are consistent. To do this, they use PCBA viewer measurement tool that employs a magnifying lens to measure small distances on circuit boards. So how can we be sure that the PCBA viewer measurement tool produces consistent measurements? To answer, answer this question, we need to find out if the measurement tool is precise. Precision describes the variation observed when measuring the same part repeatedly with the same device. Uh, in other words, precision describes the spread of these repeated measurements. Less spread means more precision. Because precision is based on variation in the results, a measurement system may be precise but not necessary on target. In the real world, measurement system precision isn't that much different from the precision of a dust throw at a dartboard. Instead of looking at the spread of dust on a dartboard, we look at the spread of measurements taken with a, uh, with a particular tool. To illustrate, let's take 10 measurements of the same circuit board with the PCBI viewer measurement tool and plot them on a dot plot. Uh, notice that the data values are between 4.5 and 5.5. To evaluate precision, we look at how spread out or variable the, measurement, uh, the measurements are. One way to do this is to look at the distribution of the, of the data. We can model the data with the normal distribution. The estimated length between components on the circuit board fall within plus and minus. Uh, three standard deviations of the mean 99.73% of the time. So is this amount of variation acceptable to the technicians at PCB Pro? We cannot answer this question unless we know the specification limits or the acceptable range of values for the length. Uh, the difference between the uh, upper and lower uh, specification limits is called tolerance. Is called tolerance. Tolerance. If our measurement system is precise, the, uh, then it doesn't contribute significant variability to the true variation in the measurements. That is. If the true value of a parameter of interest meets specification, the measurement system will measure it to above or, or below uh, the specification limit. So let's get back to our PCB Pro example. Suppose we require that the distance between components on a circuit board uh, be between uh, 4.8 and 5.2 mm. Given the specification limits, so is the PCBI viewer measurement tool adequate? And we can see here the answer is no. The PCBI viewer measurement tool contributes too much variability to the measurements. The PCBI uh, uh, the PCBI viewer uh, measurement tool is not precise enough to measure distances 
within the, these specification uh, limits. Even if the distances between the component, components are exactly the right length, the gauge might measure it to be slightly large or larger or smaller or smaller. So what if the specification limits were wider? So is the PCBI viewer measurement tool precise enough to measure circuit boards within the specification limits? And here the answer is yes, the PCBI viewer measurement tool is precise enough to measure to measure distances between these specification limits. From the graph, we can see that the probability of the gauge measuring the path outside the specification limits is essentially zero. Based on this information, our measurement system is precise. Later in this chapter, we'll, uh, we'll learn how to use a gauge repeatability and reproducibility study or gauge INR study to help evaluate the precision of a measurement system. So let's review. Precision refers to the amount of variability in the measurement system when repeated measurements are taken. We use process knowledge to decide the acceptable precision level of a measurement system. In some processes, components must fall within a certain tolerance limit range to meet standards and operate properly. Okay, so let's talk about the accuracy versus uh, precision. So let's summarize what we've learned so far. So accuracy is, uh, refers to the ability to measure the true value of a part on average, while precision refers to the variation observed when measuring the same part repeatedly with the same device, that is, consistency of the measurement system. Accuracy and precision are independent, that is, we can have a measurement that is uh, accurate but not precise, precise but not accurate, neither accurate nor precise, or both accurate and precise. So let's review. We can evaluate both accuracy and precision to determine the quality of a measurement system. Accuracy describes the ability to measure the true value of a part on average, while precision describes the variation observed when measuring the same part repeatedly with the same device. Thank you for your listening. In the next lesson, we'll talk about the repeatability and reproducibility.